So check out this channel. It's called Brothers Green Eats. Uh, these guys do very creative things with food. And um, the reason I'm starting to follow them again uh, is because they're doing a vegan challenge themselves. And their challenge is to live on a vegan diet at $50 a week. I just watched this one here. It's called Live Like a Vegan King on $50 a week, day two. And he shows you how to make some yam vegan burgers with, and he makes his own slaw, and then he makes his own beet uh, sauce, and he makes his own, uh, he actually makes his own bread too. So he, he takes you through the whole thing. The, uh, the whole video is about 15 minutes long, but this guy's worth it. And um, I, really, I really enjoy watching them because they put things together in a creative way. They're not sticking to a recipe. They're, they know how food works. They know like how savory, how sweet, how, how bland, and how, how spices work. And they, they work with that. And so I appreciate that they have this... What I learned from what I learned from them is to is to figure out how how one food and taste affects another, and then put them together to make something really good. And this is the this is the channel to watch for that. And uh, they're doing a vegan challenge, which is awesome because I want to learn how to make more of that. So they're only on day two right now. Um, I looked at their videos here, and it looks like yeah, they're taking their time. But what I am, they only got day one and day two, so I'm following along. Hopefully, they put out more videos about that. Uh, as far as day 21, today's day 21, and um, I've been eating pretty much the same things. Yeah, bananas, apples, oranges, those have been my main primary fruits. Uh, in the morning, I generally been defaulting to two toasts with peanut butter and banana and then I eat that and then I go right into workout and then right after workout I have a shower and then I eat again and I have porridge with blueberries and almond milk and that's been kind of my staple uh, lately however today I think I'm going to change it up because um, today after I ate the peanut butter with toast I, uh, I felt a little sluggish through my workout and I think maybe just maybe it might have been too much peanut butter on the toast I don't know, so I'm thinking, let's let's try something different. Maybe have a banana without the peanut butter, a toast with jam, or something like that. Just no no fat in the morning, and see how I progress through my workout. So I'll try that for a while, and then after after the workout, I'll um I'll have the porridge again. Yeah, I, I'm thinking maybe I'm eating too much peanut butter. Uh, I've been going through peanut butter quite fast because I'm having it every morning. Um, and then I'll have it for a snack sometimes too. And then, uh, oh yeah, also I've been been going through this, uh, slowly going through this. I shouldn't say slowly, it's been about four days and this thing's almost empty, uh, this Oreos. And Oreos has palm oil in it and vegetable oil. It may have canola, I don't know. It says vegetable oil, modified palm oil. So that's why it tastes good. It's because it's basically half oil and half sugars. So it says here 5 grams of fat and 9 grams of sugar per 2 cookies. So yeah, I'll, I'll have these like after a meal, like I'll have a good meal and then I'll have like 2 cookies or 4 cookies <laughs> or sometimes 6 cookies. Yeah, so it can, it can be deadly and uh, once that, there's like 3 left, once it's gone I'm, I'm not going to buy it for a while uh, <clears throat> because it's just it's a lot of refined sugar and fat. Yeah, I'm I'm trying to stay healthy and and be a little bit more mentally clear. So, the constipation that I had yesterday has cleared up today, and why is that? I don't know. I don't know. I did try I did try a turmeric smoothie. So I put turmeric in with lemon, and ginger, and a little bit of sugar and some water, and I blended that, drank it, and it was supposed to help with the help get things moving like a coffee does for me um, but it didn't work as well as a coffee but I've had that about this is my third day in a row I'm thinking maybe I gotta do it more often to get the benefits of it it's like a slow moving thing you gotta do it every day, every day. I don't know um, maybe that's what's helping so I'll try it again but I do like the taste of it it's like it's like a Jamaican 
ginger beer because you put a little bit of cayenne pepper in it to give it that spice so ginger with turmeric it's got a nice color to it it actually stained my blender plastic cup that I use uh, that stuff's powerful anyway yeah that was my update see you tomorrow bye <laughs>